In this video, you will learn 11 plus maths topic, adding and subtracting, mixing numbers with unlike denominators. Welcome to another video. If this is your first time here and you want to master 11 plus exam techniques to land in your dream grammar school, start right now by subscribing and clicking on the bell so you don't miss anything. Now let's have a look at adding mixing numbers with unlike denominators. And the example we have is 2 1 over 5 plus 1 1 over 2. So now, step 1 is going to be to convert mixed numbers into improper fraction using the MAD technique. If you guys want to know more about converting mixed numbers into improper fraction using the MAD technique, I've got a video on that. The link's in the description below. So go check that out. So now, let's start with 2 1 over 5. So 2 1 over 5 as an improper fraction will be 11 over 5. And now we can do the same thing to 1, 1 over 2. And for 1, 1 over 2, converting 1, 1 over 2 into an improper fraction, it will give us 3 over 2. So right now we have 11 over 5 plus 3 over 2. So we can move on to step 2. And step 2 is to find the LCM for both 5 and 2 and make the denominators common. The LCM for both 5 and 2 is none other than 10. The next thing we're going to do, we're going to see what number we have to multiply 5 to give us 10. And that number will be 2, because 5 times 2 gives us 10. So this means we have to multiply the 5 by 2. And what are we to do to the bottom number? We have to do to the top number. So we're multiplying the bottom number by 2. We also have to multiply the top number by 2. So now, since we've found out for 5, we can move on to 2. So what number do we have to multiply 2 to give us 10? And that number is 5, because 2 times 5 gives us 10. So now we can multiply the bottom number and the top number, because as we said before, what are we do to the bottom number? You have to do to the top number. So 11 times 2 will give us 22, and then 5 times 2 will give us 10. 3 times 5 will give you 15, and finally, 2 times 5 will give us 10. If you notice, we have 22 over 10 plus 15 over 10. And as you guys could see, both of these are like fractions. So when you have like fractions, it's going to be much more easier to add. So all we're going to do is add the numerator, so 22 plus 15, which will give us 37. And then for the denominator, because they're like we're going to leave it as it is. So it's going to be 10. So now we have 37 over 10. It's fine to leave it as 37 over 10, but teachers and exams require you to convert them into mixing numbers. And that's exactly what we are going to do. So we're going to convert 37 over 10 into a mixing number. And if you guys want to know more about converting improper fractions into mixing numbers, I've got a video on that as well. So go check that out. Now, 37 over 10 as a mixed number will be 3, 7 over 10. So this means our answer to this question is 3, 7 over 10. Now let's see how to subtract mixed numbers with unlike denominators. And the example we have is 3, 1 over 3 minus 2, 2 over 5. So now let's start with step 1. And step 1 is convert mixed numbers into improper fraction using the MAD technique. So now let's start by converting 3 1 over 3 into an improper fraction. So 3 1 over 3 as an improper fraction will be 10 over 3. So now let's move on to 2 2 over 5. So 2 2 over 5 converted into an improper fraction, it will be 12 over 5. So now we have 10 over 3 minus 12 over 5. So next thing is step 2. And step 2 is find the LCM for 3 and 5 and make the denominators common. The LCM for both 3 and 5 is none other than 15. Now we have to find what number we have to multiply 3 to give us 15. And that number is 5, because 3 times 5 will give you 15. So now this means we have to multiply 3 times 5. And if you remember, whatever you do to the bottom number, you have to do to the top number. If you multiply the bottom number by 5, you have to also multiply the top number by 5. 
So now we have found out that you have to multiply 3 by 5 to give us 15. So now let's move to 5. So what number do we have to multiply 5 to give us 15? And that number is 3 because 5 times 3 will give you 15. And once again, if we're going to multiply the bottom number by 3, we also have to multiply the top number by 3. Now, since we've found this out, the next thing is, what is 10 times 5? We know that 10 times 5 will give us 15. And then what is 3 times 5? 3 times 5 is 15. And then 12 times 3, 36. And 5 times 3 is 15. So now we have 50 over 15 minus 36 over 15. The answer to this is going to be very simple because right now it is as a like fraction. Because it's a like fraction, you only have to subtract the numerator and leave the denominator as it is. So 15 minus 36 will give you 14. And then for the denominator, as we said before, we're going to leave it as it is. So 15. So this means our answer to this question is 14 over 15. Now to learn more on level plus maps, click the video on the right. And to learn the previous topic, click the video on the left. So take your pick. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time.